What's up, everybody? Welcome into the first episode of the It's Thug Week Nasty podcast. This is a podcast that's basically going to be a audio journal or, you know, audio document of <laughs> my journey as a live streamer, whether it be Twitch or Facebook Live or Mixer or wherever we end up going. I'm going to be trying a lot of different things, you know, for science, because science rules. Oh, Bill Nye. God, I hope still every, I hope everyone still knows Bill Nye the science guy. I'm feeling a little old right now. <laughs> but yeah, so we're going to be doing stuff for science, uh, seeing what works and what doesn't work. You guys can uh, shoot me some input or things that I should try or things that I should do. You know, this is a good, you know, a little group project in your science class <laughs> for some live streaming for the It's Thug Book Nasty channel. So yes, this is the first podcast. I'll let you know a little bit about myself. Well, <laughs> if you could hear that, uh, the podcast is 100% recorded, pretty much, in my car, to and from my full-time job. You know, you got to make the best of the time that you have. And basically, my 40-some minute drive to work is a complete waste of time. So, doing this seems like a really good idea. <laughs> but you get those sound effects via an asshole on a motorcycle that's ripping through lots of traffic. Whatever. Anyways... <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, so a little bit about myself. First off, it's so nasty. Where did the name come from? Because everyone always, well, you see this dude, you know, you look at me and you're like, this guy's not a thug. He doesn't look too nasty. I don't think that's a wick. <laughs> Anyways, so the name, way back, again, dating myself. This is probably early 2000s. Um, I was probably in high school at the time. Yeah, definitely in high school. Uh, Facebook had these name generators. I don't know if anyone remembers these things, but they had these name generators where you would put in like maybe a first initial and a birth month or whatever, and then it would just come up with a with a with a name. Like there was like fairy name generators. And it was like, oh, you're Mr. Twinkos, you know. Uh, but this this case, it was the uh, the thug name generator <laughs> and it ended up coming up with Thugwig Nasty and it kind of stuck so I was playing I think World of Warcraft at the time so I had a character named Thugwig Nasty I think it was a paladin blood elf if anyone really cares um, uh, no it was a night elf whatever it's been a long time <clears throat> so that's that's where I first used the name and then it eventually made it onto my Xbox uh, gamer tag and then now it's just everything all right, so a little bit more about me personally. I am in my early 30s, meaning I was born in the 80s. It was an awesome time to be alive. <laughs> you know, stuff's going back. It's, you know, everyone's thrown back to these retro 80s stuff. I love nostalgia. I think most people of my generation really do love nostalgia, and I do as well. Um, I am married. Actually, today is my two-year anniversary to my wife. She's wonderful. She reads many books. She's a teacher. I don't know how anyone be, is a teacher, man. Uh, I don't know how they do it, but she could do it. So she's definitely, you know, my better half. I love fitness and weight training. You know, I had a, uh, I was a bit overweight in high school in my younger years. Definitely was not healthy. I ate a lot of bad food, made a lot of bad choices, wasn't very active. I had asthma that wasn't well controlled, you know, and then one day I decided that uh, I want to take control of my life and, and really have a say. <laughs> you know, what I put in my body and what I do for my body. And uh, it's been a huge difference maker in my life. And uh, I love it. And especially with us gamers, we really gotta, we really gotta focus on being healthier, man. We can't just sit down, play six hours of video games and, and assume that it's not doing anything to our body. So you gotta be aware, guys. Stay hydrated, eat healthy foods, stay active, and make sure you play video games too. You know, it's, it's the, the circle of happiness. <laughs> um, but I love playing video games and I love entertaining people so video games plus streaming and entertaining people you put those two things together and it's like euphoria nah maybe not that but it's pretty it's pretty sweet so I really feel like this is a, a great avenue for me personally um, 
to uh, take a trip down. So we'll see where we're gonna end up. You know, I have high hopes, but it's really the drive and determination that gets people to where they wanna go. So just talking it through on a podcast like this with you guys, maybe getting some of your feedback is only gonna help me drive to be better and drive to actually stay with it and determined to you know go out and get it. Because obviously I have a full-time job, I am a graphic artist by trade, you know, 40 hours, 40 plus hours a week now. Um, I love doing artwork. And that's why a lot of my stuff that you'll see on my channel is like, it's pretty good stuff. You know, I'm, I am a professional. I did go to college for it. I, you know, I'm not the greatest artist, but I am pretty good. You know, so a lot of stuff you'll see looks pro. You know, it's like a, like that's why my, <laughs> I always get asked sometimes, it's like, man, why does this stream look so pro? And then you have like no nobody in here. And it's like, well, it's because I'm a graphic artist and I love doing art and, you know, everything I do, I, I like it to look good, you know? So that's, that is that. So that's why my stuff looks good, guys. If you don't like it, then fine, fine. <laughs> okay, so on the podcast weekly, I'm going to do what I'm calling last week review or LWR if you need an acronym. Too many syllables in those words. Um, so weekly, what I want to basically do is talk about last week as a whole. So I want to talk about how the streams went last week, um, bring up anything that's notable, anything that was beneficial or helpful for the stream, anything that was detrimental, something I should have done maybe or wanted to do and didn't get done. Uh, we'll talk about the things that I did get done, new things for the stream or new things on social media or you know just anything notable that I feel like talking about that happened in the past week. We'll be doing it here weekly on the LWR. So last week, I had one stream on Friday. So lately, I've only been streaming one day on Friday nights because my wife works on Friday nights um, at a second job. Don't worry about it. But she works, so I figured this is a good time to start, you know, streaming because I can play for an extended period of time without not spending time with my wife. So last Friday, uh, Stream went okay. I talked as much as I could. I struggle a little bit. I definitely struggle a little bit when I'm playing with friends, especially if they're constantly in my ear and sometimes, you know, I'll have their voice chat coming through the game. And I mean, most of the time it's, not, we're having very, I mean, they're having personal conversations where, where I'm trying to have conversations about the game or conversations with chat. And sometimes I feel like it doesn't, it doesn't really play well. So I might end up just muting you know, their mics so that I'm hearing it, but then sometimes it'll sound like I'm talking to myself, but um, you gotta do what you gotta do. If the conversations aren't great, you know, for stream, you know, or for entertainment value, then, you know, I, I don't wanna give you guys something that doesn't have any value. So that's, that's how that stream went. It was uh, lackluster. The room was very warm for some reason. It was so hot, I was sweating. I don't know what was going on that day. Anyways. So yeah, that was last week. I uh, met a couple cool streamers last week. I like to, you know, sift around in some of these smaller streamers, you know, in the in the teens, you know, maybe viewers, something like that. Um, just because they're they're the next level for me, you know. I'm I'm in the one or two viewer category. They're in the the teen agories. <laughs> teen agory. Ah. But they're in the teens of viewers, you know. I just want to kind of move up the ranks like that. So I want to I want to meet some other people that are closer to the level or just above me so that I can start, you know, up-leveling myself to get to their level. And then we move up and move up. You know, that's kind of how I'm looking at it. But uh, definitely checked out a cool streamer. Whiskey Mage was one. Very cool dude. Super chill, super lax. I really like uh, lax streamers, you know, that just enjoy playing the game. They talk to the chat, you know, they enjoy your company. Um, yeah, so he was cool, Whiskey Mage, shout out. And then the other one was a, a, a dude from Down Under. We had uh, Alpha Aztec, really cool dude. He lives the health and fitness lifestyle as well, but also loves that video gaming. And he seemed, again, super lax dude, pretty decent at PvP in Destiny. But yeah, I checked those two dudes out, so there's your shout out, guys. If you ever listen to this, you were the first two shout outs <laughs> in the LWR. All right, so here's the plans for this week. So we got the LWR out of the way, and now we're gonna do this week's plans. So my plan is that Wednesday, 
or Thursday, I'm gonna try Facebook Live. So this is another platform. Right now I'm currently on Twitch, but I'm gonna try Facebook Live for science. So basically this, this is the base I'm going for, okay? This is what I wanted to do. I'm not gonna have anyone follow my page. I'm gonna play an oversaturated game. I'm not gonna market myself or tell anyone that I'm playing games. I know, this sounds like super, super counterproductive, right? My whole point of this study, if you will, is that I wanna see if anything comes organically. So if anybody shows up in my chat, one person even, one or two people without me having to ask people or you know tell people that I'm going live, that's a huge plus in the, the Facebook Live category because on Twitch, that rarely happens. So I've been back for four weeks now. I think I've had four or five streams and I haven't organically, nobody has come in, even with all my, you know, me marketing myself on Twitter or Instagram, nobody that wasn't already a follower or an IRL friend has stopped by my channel at all. So that's why I'm trying this test. I wanna see if anything comes about organically. And um, yeah, that'll be a good testament for Facebook Live going forward. So again, this is all for science. I'm testing. I'm seeing what best suits my needs, and we'll see where we go going forward.